So we always had the idea to design a LiDAR system which is small and lightweighted and it should fit in our Trinity. But we also didn't want to do any compromise on quality. We always had in mind that we need a survey grade geodetic LiDAR system and therefore we decided to ask our partner Yellowscan to cooperate with us and design a system for Trinity. We have designed a state-of-the-art LiDAR system that is lightweight and accurate. I quickly got the feeling that they were as excited as we were and also the collaboration with Yellowscan was super nice. We were just from the very start on one level and uh, the discussions went back and forth as if they were in-house. So there was nothing, to be, nothing more to be wished for. Also, um, when we finally got the prototypes, uh, this paid off because we did not have any integration problems. They did their homework, we did our homework and everything fit together perfectly. So it's good news for our customers already owning a Trinity because they can just buy the LiDAR payload and uh, capture uh, very accurate and survey grade LiDAR data. It's the perfect trade-off between weight, operation range and data quality. And this is the first time that such a compact LiDAR system can be brought on board a hybrid vertical takeoff and landing UAV. So then when the final day come, I was still excited, but the tests went like a charm. We have this uh, super nice system from Yellowscan. It's really a one button solution, literally a one button solution. So we pressed the button, flew the mission, came back and were just uh, astonished by the data quality we got. In the mission, we had several altitudes that we flew on between 80 and 120 meters. And in those altitudes, uh, the data was just even better than we expected. Well, this is a system where all, all geodetic engineers, all surveyors, all mappers should be interested in, especially when they are trying to map terrain under forest, terrain under vegetation, or they are using it in big open pit mines just to save time. Because if you would compare a LiDAR survey to a photogrammetry survey, you will understand that the LiDAR survey will not need any post-processing, like the photogrammetry mosaicing of the photos. You fly a huge open pit mine, and right after the flight, you have the complete accurate 3D model of the pit. The combination of Cube and Trinity is a perfect tool for highly productive uh, survey job from UAVs. This is, for me, a sign that we did the right decision. We did it and congratulations to the engineers who actually did the job.